Good morning, everyone. It's 5.45 in the morning. We are going to Aspen. Woo! I'm vlogging. Honestly, this should just become a YouTube channel of me, Emily, and Ryan's adventures. No, just kidding. I would never share. Emily's here. Ryan's about to pick us up. We are just about to get our shiz together. I overpacked so much, but whatever. I will check in once we are on the road. How are you doing? Mm. I know, me too. Two animals in the wild. I think the buffalo chicken's good. At six in the morning. We got dots. We're so jazzed about that. I didn't vlog anything really on the plane. There was nothing to share. But we landed in Denver and now we're going on the rental car shuttle. <laughs> To go to what? <laughs> Just looking around. To go get a car that we rented to go fast in. Renting cars is just like our thing. Yeah, I'm having so much um, deja vu too. Utah? Arizona. Yeah. That was Utah. Oh, Arizona. We, we flew to Arizona, sweetie. Yeah. The Denver airport is a lot. It's all I'll say. It's a hellscape. If I were to describe <laughs> it in one word, it's almost worse than Times Square. Can't wait to see what party that is. Daddy. Daddy. Okay, Back it's where like we belong. Sweltering hot. Hi. But you take your jacket off. Yep. I don't know if I can drive in that. How do I get out of the gates? That was a journey. Just pop your way to the top, Emily. We are gonna. We're <laughs> looking for somewhere to get food, and then we're gonna begin. How long is the drive? Three hours and forty-eight minutes. We have a new tradition. If you guys watch the Utah vlog, to go to In and Out. I was saying before that I should just rename my YouTube channel to Travels with Emily and Ryan. That's really all I vlog. Everything. Yeah, 50 chicken fingers, right. 60 chicken fingers. We want some more. How do we get in? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't post that. Why? Are you not allowed to go to Hi. Who? Not allowed. You've arrived at your destination. <laughs> we get canes after. Sure. No, maybe we can get that on the bird bag. It's just chicken fingers and sauce. And the sauce is saucing. It is so good. The fries. Do fries? I would get Chick-fil-A fries. Um, you know what? I don't even know if oh, fries. Yeah, they have fries. Uh, they have fries. Animal fries, I can't have. Yes, you can. It's just onions and cheese. I thought bacon. Fries last time were saga Yeah, you know what? From where? Saga-licious. Yeah. It was midnight. Grilled cheese for me. Burger for Emily. Burger for the king. So much sushi and sushi <laughs> Guys, we just ate. We got to the hotel. I just showered. We are all sharing a room. Emily's naked, but we are staying at. She is not. No. I mean, don't turn it off. Yeah. Um, we're staying at the inn at Aspen, and it's actually perfection for what we need because it's literally ski in, ski out. Like, look, like right there, that's a mountain, and we can just step out. Step on out. Step on step, out. Step. Stepping on out. Anyway, we are gonna start getting ready for the evening. We're going to dinner and we're all just unpacking and like taking a second because it was the longest travel day ever. We're playing a fun game of what was the most torturous parts of the day. I'll start. Number one was waking up at 5.30, 5.20. For me, it was definitely walking to the airport. I was about to say, the walk in LaGuardia. We haven't spoken about Wait, it. I don't no, remember no. that. Oh, Denver. both of them. Both were horrible. You keep complaining about the LaGuardia walk. Guys, the walk was literally over a mile. I think I was asleep. Oh, maybe. Yeah, the walk is at LaGuardia because obviously we had to get the furthest gate in all of Terminal C. I don't remember boarding. And the furthest baggage claim. Always, always. Also the furthest room in this hotel. <laughs> um, oh, it's slipping. We didn't take, we took off like what, a half hour? Ish late. We didn't, we're we supposed to take off at 7.30 and I remember I was still texting in my family chat at like 8.01. Yeah, we were still landed early. But then we had to wait. Yes, yeah, so then we landed at 10.07 and then we didn't get off the plane until 10.53. And what else? Oh, the walking through the Denver airport. Mm. That was... Talk about a loopy... I feel like I was making laughs, rights, ups, downs, yeah. crowds. I will say the hi a highlight was our bags yeah. at baggage claim right away. Except and these two girls in the airport... <laughs> no, I know. These two girls in the airport kept hitting you with their suitcase. <laughs> Oh, I was like, Because you weren't rocket walking fast enough. <laughs> it was happening, like, I was behind you, I just saw that, but then... And then the walk to the shuttle. Through the slush. Through the slush, of course, is the last one. And then the that rental was, was fine after that, yeah. And then the drive was fine. In and out was nice, too. Yeah, because she tried to up, up charge us. It's honestly disgusting. 
there. By the way, I think in and out is not good. Well, that's hopefully the end of the torturousness. And all in all, it wasn't even that bad. We made it and we're here and we're laughing. Yeah, and we have our luggage. Oh, hello. How's it going? Yeah, what was risky was bringing my foundation without a bottle top. No, you didn't. I couldn't find it. Do you have extra ponytails? Yeah. What? Does the bathroom feel like a little... Do you need that? In a second. Yeah. Are you gonna, uh, do you need no, it? I wasn't. Oh, interesting. Because you just asked if you need a ponytail. I said, yeah. I asked. <laughs> what? You asked if I had one. That's true. How do you know I was going to follow up and be like, I need? You don't. You're right. So can I use Yeah, of course. Uh oh. I'm a crazy person. <laughs> it's called being polite. You should try it sometime. What? It's a really bad mirror. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Because I, I got off the plane and it kind of. Oh, it's so ugly. <laughs> it was a little bit black. I came into the shower with that. Man, it's my shampoo. <laughs> How else do you expect me to transport shampoo? Well, they sell actually at CVS like these little bottles. Not keratin set, not keratin. No, no, empty ones. They're travel oh, sizes. You yeah. put your shampoo yeah, yeah, in. Right. They're really great. They're really convenient. They yeah. Have. And you can even put them in your car down. Yeah. No, for sure. Okay, we are ready for dinner. This is my outfit. I kind of hate it, but whatever. We survived. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Can't wait to eat. Ryan, tell everyone what's going on. We're just here at the bus station, and we're not waiting for the bus. We're waiting for the hotel to come bring us out. <laughs> How's that going for us? The bus came in my plane, <laughs> but the hotel's not here. What did we do? I didn't really we do anything. Dinner. We had sushi. I had we sushi. drank a lot. We drank a lot. We mm -hmm. ate dessert. It was great. It was, great. It was delicious. Good, good times, good conversations. Good morning, Ryan. How was it? Get on the bed time to hit the slopes. Ryan's going to school today. Woohoo! Class is in session. Bitch. Hey. <laughs> oh. Did you get goggles? Did you buy Did them? Did I get goggles? Do you buy or rent? But only option, cheapest option there, 180. Oh, are they Oakley? I have no idea. I go, hi, put me in the direction of the most affordable option. <laughs> <laughs> are they? Yeah. Turn them around. Oh, those are nice goggles. Nice. She was yeah. like, these are good ones. Yeah, they like, are. They better be better than the three hundred dollar option. So what's your plan now? Gonna chill. I saw the flag out there. It was like all adult lessons, and then a separate one for adult first timer. I'm like, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm gonna like stay away. Okay, we're ready for the first day in the slopes. Um, this is my outfit, Cordova. Oh, there you go. I forgot to show you, but we got food. Container punch. Fueling up for our big day on the slopes. Okay, we got our skis, our boots, our helmets, and we're ready to go. Fucking sweaty. Um, and honestly, everyone here is so nice. Yeah. Like, everyone's cracking jokes. Yeah. Except the guy who checked me in, like, kept questioning the fact that I knew how to ski. He was like, is this your first time? I was like, no. And he was like, he was like, are you taking a lesson today? I was like, I really feel like you don't think I know how to ski. Like, I don't know why. Maybe it's like the outfit. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna hit the slopes. I'll vlog from the slopes if I'm feeling confident. Okay, we're about to start skiing. Stunning outside today. Stunning. What kind of skier would you say you are? Oh, I don't know. I would say we're both novice, but we know how to ski. Yeah. Like leisurely. Yeah. Like, like not nice. trying to challenge ourselves. Yeah. Like just enjoy. Sometimes like a little, little jump. Just like jump? Oh. Oh no. I've never jumped in my life. No, no, no. Where are we going to encounter jumps? Aren't they on like harder? Oh, like Sometimes they on blues. Oh, on blues. We'll see if we'll get to blues. I feel like blues we might get to tomorrow. I feel like today's about warming up. One run. That's true. Well, we'll see you on the slopes. How we doing? Great. Great. Never been better. Emily shit her pants. <laughs> I did. Almost. I really get, yeah. I don't know, the altitude really gets me. I started having the sweats down the mountain. I thought I was going to pass out. And I stripped when I got down, ran to the bathroom, gave Margo my layers. Yeah, I'm cold. And I feel good. I really think I was overheated. Yeah. Look how gorgeous. We've reunited with Ryan. We're having a brewski and a quick bite. Cheers. I don't know if you can hear us over this rock and roll. 
but we'll check in with him and he can give us a lowdown on yeah, school, all about school later when you can hear us. Okay, we didn't really. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Yeah, okay. We didn't really check in um, on the remainder of the afternoon. Okay. We are ready for dinner ish. We're going to Snow Lodge, which is Surf Lodge in Hampton's sister, brother, I don't know. And then we have dinner at 8 30. This is my outfit. Shoes. So cute, Ryan. So cute. Yeah, I like it. I'm a little now. cuter. But I'll show you. Sweater, jeans. Hold on, we're getting a FaceTime from That's Emily. It. That my fingers got some blood. <laughs> it's not. There's no blood. There's no blood. I just broke it. No, you. <laughs> my whole nail's purple. Because our hands are cold. Because it's no, cold. No, dude, it's bleeding <laughs> under my nail. Dude, did you just call me too? Ryan, give us an update. Well, you know. We've had some setbacks. Mm -hmm. I broke my hand. Oh my god, I haven't seen the finger since. So I'm going to the hospital. No, you're not. I urgent care. <laughs> um, and I'm going to get this bad boy checked out and drained. Yeah. And I'll see you on the slopes right after. Will you? Well, TBD. <laughs> okay, we're ready for day two. Besides Ryan, who's going to urgent care. This is my outfit. Can you see it? It's Fendi. It's really cute. I like it a lot, even though. I kind of look manly. It's all good. Oh. Emily's trying to put on her shoes. I got it. Oh, you got it? Yeah. I'm gonna need some help for sure. Um, the wow, the looks good. Just did a bunch of runs, but we're gonna do one last one before we have to get ready for the day. But we just wanted to check in. Ready? Oh, yeah. Alright, Tony. The one who sees me right now probably thinks I'm nuts. But I gotta get them. And snow mass. Yeah. So I'm like, all right, the drive to snow mass. Beautiful drive. You know, I just got there, I waited for an hour, got my little finger drained. They're like, are you squeamish? You like needles? I'm like, no, I don't. So we're gonna have you lay down. They take out this like big tool. So they like burn a hole in your nail and then squeeze it. And then they were like, then the doctor like, all right, we're gonna bring you in for your x ray next. I'm like, no, you know, I think it's fine. I think it's just a hematoma because that's what Allie <laughs> described it as. And you know, they sucked the blood on out like a vamp, and here I am. And then I went to Carl's Pharmacy to, to buy some tampons from my friend Margo, <laughs> um, who decided not to answer her phone while I was there. So there I went. You did a good job though. Tampax, instead of put like, if they didn't have Playtex, like that, that worked. I was walking up the aisle Carl's <laughs> Pharmacy for us all. Your daughter will be lucky you had some Yeah, hundred percent good, nice um perspective there. And when do you guys decide to call me? As soon as I walk out with the purchase and I'm <laughs> in the car, needing the waves, but also backing up into the middle of the street, and then all of a sudden the street. Okay, how would back, we know that? No backup camera, no waves, just Emily Humphrey is calling. <laughs> But I'm here. Sue me. Yes. Seven missed calls. I was just trying to give you a ring back. All right. I'll check back in and see how this day can turn. Get any better. To see where we can Ew. get to. No, 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 no. Oh my fucking God. Holy shit. She's so help. nasty. You are disgust. Is, is the camera on? Yeah. <laughs> you see this knapsack? This has been through college, every plane in the world, like, ev like everywhere. And she just lifted it up and put it on my bed where I sleep every night. Just so but she can what, film a little video. Anyway, this is my outfit. We're going to Snow Lodge today. Cynthia Rowley, so it's the bag. Okay. Everyone already saw your outfit, so. Oh, yeah. You're on This is my outfit. It says snow. It was styled by Margo. Mm -hmm. um, this is Topshop. Style by Ryan. These are Obermeyer. Is it Topshop? Yeah, Topshop did a ski like oh, line. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Wish me luck with them. We stopped for wraps before we go because we are starving. Mukbang. Can 
give everyone an update for at Snow Lodge. We're actually having so much fun. Yeah, it's fun. We went to Snow Lodge Goodbyes. last night and we're gonna be honest. It's yeah. not good. <laughs> But today we're in the courtyard. Today it's much more fun. Goodbye. Emily's in the bathroom, obviously, but I pretended I had to go because I wanted to go inside because my hands are freezing. Oh, it's good. It's so sceny here. It's the craziest like, thing. Like beyond. Like I, I have something Hill. controversial. Yeah, I have something controversial to say. Everyone's at Pitsack. That and I don't like the scene. Because it's really people from all walks of life. And no, and it just like gives me agita. Yeah. Whereas like. When we're on our trips to Utah, and we're never gonna run into oh, anybody ever. Oh, you don't like scene in general? I don't like scene yeah. in general. Totally. Well, we're in the sceniest place in the world. No, so. I know, and I, I literally said I want to go to Aspen because I want to see the scene. I like, I want to be in the scene. Me too. No, I'm like, no. I don't have to speak. <laughs> and also, oh, me and Ryan were having this conversation because Emily's like, whenever she runs into someone, even it could be someone she legitimately despises. Chatty Kathy over there. For 30 minutes. We're always like, oh my god, how do you know that person? Like, I just met them. I'm like, wait, why? And me and Ryan are like, we see some of me now. I'm like, I'm like, hi, how are you? Keep like, walking. Like, oh, I'm just, I'm sorry, I'm running to find my friend. <laughs> That's just a little bit about us. us. <laughs> Not Emily. <laughs> We're back at the bathroom. Oh, the last time we vlogged at the bathroom, we had a whole yeah. saga about like the scene and how you're chatty Kathy and how we're not. Brian's not chatty Kathy? No, when I haven't spoken to once this whole trip. Like, we're very much like, hi, how are you? Bye. And you're very much like, chatty. Can you Um. Anyway, so we met some people and he just went to the bathroom and just handed us this. We just went to the bottle of tequila. Okay, cheers. I wish it was right. One meatball. One meatball, one boy. <laughs> Honestly, this looks so good. <laughs> Has anyone listened to the toast recently? We are back at the hotel. We are changing just to go out. I don't really, we don't really know. Ask a swear. We can't because I, there's no answer. But this is my outfit. We're going to be cold. We're going to be cola, but that's all I have to really say. Do you guys have anything to add? I can think of some funny things to say. Also, by the way, we are podcasting about life and this trip, which you could probably listen to sooner than you could watch this. So just go to Best of <laughs> Best of Both Podcasts. Oh, I didn't even tell everyone what happened to yeah, me last like, night. Do you want to? Mm, I don't really think that they need to know. So I woke up at 3.30 in the morning because I <laughs> had to go to the bathroom so bad. And I also had to throw up at the same time. And we are saying that it's alti altitude, but mine hits me in the middle of the night and apparently Emily's hits her in the <laughs> middle of the slopes because it happened to her twice today. But you know what's the difference? That's interesting. It's the Michigan difference is it that to I, when I got back into bed, I was sh shivering on well, like so not okay. But what happens to you, you sweat your ass off. Wait, did you just say the Michigan difference in the Yeah, because I said the difference, and I felt like I had to say the Michigan difference because I'm in the presence of two Michigan right. people. Right! Good morning, everyone. We returned our skis this morning. We're not skiing. It's like the sun's not out, so it honestly would be a miserable day. Also, we're over it. But Emily and I are preparing to take some photos in our matching juicy tracksuits. Woo! And then Ryan is creative director. Wow, look at that. I'm the creative director. Juicy. Hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> Live from our photo shoot. We're doing the Magnolia. Very accurate. It's very accurate, if you know. It's 10.45 and we're acting like we are in the biggest rush ever. We're just going into town for the day. We're gonna shop, we're gonna eat, we're gonna chill. We're gonna drink. We're gonna drink. Oh, and I need some caffeine. I need some caffeine. We just had the biggest meal ever, and now we are shopping. We're on a mission. I want pants like the ones I borrowed from Emily. They're just white jeans. I don't have good white jeans. It's so pretty for, you know, different occasions. Portugal. Yeah. yeah. We're going to Brian's 40th in Portugal, and he's having like a Oh, this is a little bit out of my budget right now. <laughs> um, 8 dollars That's good. He's really fast about this shirt. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> This is, I'm just his hanger. <laughs> you guys, this is why shopping with Brian is a sport because he's so good at it. Like, look at that. Those you pants are fucking sick. Back up. Give, give us a show. <gasps> yes. Oh my God, yes. Emily's getting the same pants as Ryan. 
They look so good. I mean, I could literally never wear them, but they're not very me. They're not very me. Okay, guys, we just had such an amazing adventure. We got sunglasses, and I came into this trip wanting to purchase sunglasses. These are the ones I got. Prada, and then Emily wasn't intending on making a purchase. And I did so quick. I'm having so much fun. Me too. <laughs> Ryan. This is cool. We've settled on this and the cardigan. Oh, we're doing the haul? You go first because you did the best. First, we just got these pants. They're like gray wool. Some pleats are cropped in like a little baggy. You know, good for a night on the town. Uh -huh. Dinner. This hat. This hat is his pride and joy. Like a little Aspen motif. We got a skier on the mountain, that's me, minus the skiing. We got this little denim shirt. We got a plain black t shirt, you know, 50% off. Crazy sale. Crazy sale. Pitkin County. Something. Pickin County Dry Goods. Yep. Best store, worst bags. This little Bodhi shirt He's with like, how with cool, them. like little, like embellished, 50% off. We also got this cool funky cardigan. The same oh, place I, I got my hat. Parts of it is Fair Isle. Yeah. Fair we got this little splitter. There's an American flag on there. And these little pantalones. We got Sick some patches. Right. We got some things. Did you wear those tonight? I think I might wear these yeah, tonight. Yeah, you should. And so that's it. My turn. I didn't get nearly as much. I did get these Prada sunglasses, which you guys saw. I was really in the market for a brown because all the ones that I own are black. Then I needed fresh denim because all the ones that I have don't fit me. So we have these just classic blue jeans from Redone. They fit like a glove. And then I wore Emily's um, white pants today to make me want white pants. So I got these like flare. You know what mine was the most? We had so much fun in the process. We did actually have a lot of fun. I got these sunglasses. <laughs> Oh, you can see my sweater now. Yeah, this is also a haul for me. Yeah, because he like, was not involved. This really nice sweater. Warm. Oh, I do like it. That's because Oh, it's nice. nice. And the mm -hmm. piece savings is shirt. Love That's all. It. Show the back. Cat hair t shirt. She's very cool. Anyway, we are just going to chill for a minute. We've had the longest day, and then we have dinner at 9 30. What time is it? Next 5 30. Oh, amazing. Hey. Final night outfit. This is her final outfit and this is mine. Okay, this is my outfit. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I did see someone in this outfit and decide to copy it. I had this already, but the girl was wearing white flare jeans and today I went out and bought white flare jeans and like, that's what we call influencing. But yeah, that's it. And then that's really all I have to say. We're about to podcast. So this is our setup. It's extremely professional. It's also midnight, so that's good. And Ryan is just the star of the show. Make my debut. Yep. Hats off to you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, so <laughs> Amazing. Fires looks good. Oh my god, that looks insane. But she's gonna eat this and be full for the next 10 hours. I realized I just showed you guys a bunch of wraps without explaining what's going on. We are driving to the airport, but it's snowing. But we stopped back at that deli. We stopped on the way in to get wraps and it was really good. And now we're getting back in the car. They were giving out free bread and Emily had to get it and it's legitimately so heavy. Oh my god, it smells. But the question is, how is she getting it home? We stopped to get gas and it's so beautiful. However, it's so windy, like Ryan's blown away. Five hours later and two pimples later. <laughs> We made it to Denver. We oh, made it. I mean, I wish I had a hat like this. I have a third eye. We made it to the rental car place, and there was a there was a shuttle pulling up, and I literally was like, "Everyone, get the run it the fuck out of the car and get on there." Which thank God we did. Yeah. And then we just got here. There's so many people. I mean, I just I feel like I say this every time. If you don't have pre-check and clear, you absolutely have to get it. Like the yeah, it, the difference. Yeah. I, for sure. But did you see the regular line and the other security? No, but I would imagine. It was like a festival. Yeah. <laughs> and then we just had to hike to our gate. But we're here and we have like 20 minutes to spare. So all in all, we are grateful to have made it. It was a track. Thank you. And just like that. We're home. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. We had a blast as always. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know. Like, subscribe, comment, all the things. <laughs> And we'll catch up. Oh my God. We'll catch you on the next one.